For centuries, humans have taken it for granted that they were in the most still and stable place in the universe, observing that everything in the sky seemed to move, except the earth, which appeared to be still. Today we know that this is not the case. The earth is constantly moving, even if we do not notice it, and nothing in the universe can be said to be absolutely stationary. Talking about the speed of the earth only makes sense with respect to a reference system. Starting from the Earth's rotation, which at its maximum speed at the equator reaches about 1,670 km per hour, passing through its orbit around the Sun at about 107,000 km per hour, we arrive at the movements of the Sun in the Milky Way, which also involve the Earth, with a speed of about 885,000 km per hour with respect to the galactic center. But that's not all, our galaxy is moving toward Andromeda at over 400,000 km per hour while our entire galactic group is heading toward a gigantic concentration of mass, called the Great Attractor, at more than 2 million kilometers per hour. However, these movements should not be confused with the expansion of the universe, which involves the dilation of space itself, allowing distant galaxies to move away from us even faster than the speed of light, without violating relativity. As a global reference, we can consider the cosmic microwave background radiation, a uniform, C, of photons left over from the Big Bang, which offers a useful system for measuring relative motions on a cosmic scale. With respect to this cosmic background, the Earth is moving at about 370 km per second, or about 1,332,000 km per hour, a value calculated by observing the Doppler shift of the radiation in directions opposite to our motion. 